Hello, Pisces. Welcome to Blunt Sagittarius. My name is Robin. And Pisces, today we're going to do a general love reading, baby. Let's talk about you and love. Let's see what's going on, what's been going on. If nothing's been going on, let's see what's coming down the chute. Let's talk about you, Pisces. Spirit guides, what up with the Pisces Collective? Talk to us. Okay, so we have honeymoon. Enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. I could be taking a vacation. We also have codependency. So addictions are affecting your romantic life. All right, let's talk about this here, Pisces. Let's discuss this. Pisces, for those of you who are interested, I am doing personal readings. If you want one, the link is in the description box below. So we have some confusion or maybe a misunderstanding. Whoa, we start with the tower. We got the six of cups. We got the ace of swords in reverse. We got the six of swords. I understand what's going on here. Okay, what else we got here for Pisces? Yeah, we have the page of cups. Okay, what else? Whoa, oh no, I just, that's not good. Look what happened to my card, baby. But the moon's in reverse, which is Pisces energy. We got the page of wands. We got two pages, a lot of messages here. It's very clear to me what's up. Hold on, let me fix my beautiful card here. Like, damn, damn, I don't know my card's broken. All right, page of wands, one more card. We'll get in the middle, or sorry, and then we'll get into your reading here, Pisces. All right. And we got the nine of cups. Wow. And on the bottom, yeah, the two of pentacles. Oh, you got a choice to make, baby. You got a choice to make. Let's make sure those are on camera. Pisces, here's a situation. You're about to get a shocking message. Not sure you're expecting this because the tower is here. So somebody wants to transform this connection. They want to make a grand return into your life. Uh, they think there's been a misunderstanding here because the ace of swords is in reverse. They want to clarify things. They want to bring things to light here. What do you want to say about the Ace of Swords in reverse? What are they coming to say? What do they want? What? Are, whoa, hold on. We got the Three of Swords, Death, Ten of Cups, Knight of Swords, and the Four of Wands. They're hurting. They're lonely. They're sorrowful without you here, Pisces. Page of Cups, yeah. But we got three pages. Three pages and the Moon in reverse. So we'll discuss that. But three pages in a reading typically means there's an argument. It could mean um, a lot of an age difference, a lot of young people, a lot of immature energy. Um, so this person wants to come in and rectify things. They want to they want to change the direction of this connection, this relationship. Um, I mean, maybe addictions are the reason that there was a separation in the first place. Uh, but they want harmony. They want balance. They see you as their soulmate, their happiness, their end all, the one for them, the love of their life. Here's a knight of swords. So they want to rush forward. They want to move forward. They want to reconnect with you. Uh, they don't want to live without you here, Pisces. Six of Swords, again, moving forward. Page of Cups is telling you. Let's talk about, because look, at we have two we have two cards of confusion, misunderstanding, um, secrets. What do you want to say about this moon in reverse here? What's this energy here? Whoa, Two of Wands in reverse. The Fool in reverse. The Five of Wands. They're prepared to fight for you. Um... What they know is you're the one for them. They think this is a misunderstanding. They think this is a miscommunication. They're extremely disappointed. They're frustrated. They want to fight this out. They want to battle this. They want to talk about this. They want to heal this. They want to give to this. Like I said, you're exactly what they want. There's a three of wands and the high priestess, which is Pisces. They want you, nobody but you. They want to heal this. They want to give to this. They want to work through this. They're really going to fight for this. Here's the page of wands and the knight of cups. You're their dream come true, wish fulfillment. You're everything they want in a person, Pisces, and they aren't willing to let you go. So you have a connection here where this person's coming back. They want to clear the air. They think it's been a big misunderstanding, a big misconfusion. They want to show you how much they love you. The page of wands and the nine of cups is let me show you how much I love you. Let me tell you. Talk is cheap. I'm going to walk the walk. I talk the talk. I'm going to walk the walk. So they want the opportunity to show you how much you mean to them. They want to, um, well, they don't want to live without you, Pisces. So <laughs> that's what's going on. You got a big decision here to make. Uh, they want to transform this connection. Let's grab some oracles. Let's see what they want to say. Spirit guides, what is Pisces? Okay, here we go. Worry, okay. Make a commitment not to lead an anxiety-driven life. When worries arise, breathe them out of your body, focus on the power of your heart, and have faith that spirit is guiding you always. Pisces, let's get the caring connection. Spirit guides, caring connection for Pisces. Love. Yeah, that's true, that's true, that's true. Love conquers all. All right, Pisces, let's get the hidden truth. So if this person could say something that they're not saying they want to say, they should, maybe they shouldn't, but you need to know, baby. Let's find out. Let's find out. 
Okay. Ooh, I'm gonna back. I regret lying to you. I hide behind material things. I hid who I really am. Wow. This person, well, maybe that's the miscommunication or misunderstanding is they didn't give you the opportunity to know who they are. Um, they didn't let you get, uh, hmm. well, let's see if that changes. Let's see if you give them the opportunity now to show you who they really are. Let's get your potential outcome. So Pisces, when I say potential, there's always free will. You're going to make the decisions you're going to make. And when I say outcome, where are you in a month? What do you decide to do? You got a decision here to make. They want this connection. You are everything that they want. They want a life with you. They want to clear this up. We got the page. All four pages came out in this reading. Oh, wow. There's the page of cups in reverse. There's the eight of cups. Well, there's big regrets here. So eight of cups in reverse, page of cups in reverse, page of swords. Okay. The world. The hanged man and the star. What's under the world there? The queen of pentacles. Could be dealing with an earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I mean, all the signs are out because all the pages came out here at Pisces. Stars, Aquarius, energy. They have regrets. They, um, they drop the ball and they know it. They have regrets. They're learning from this experience. They're hoping and praying that you will take them back or forgive them or understand or move forward. They're literally like on bended knee asking for your forgiveness, telling you they really want to work this out. They want another chance here. But you're still stuck on this energy. The hangman is there. You're still trying to decide what's best for you. The world tells me that you have some healthy boundaries set up here. You're str there's judgment. There's death and rebirth. So I don't see you making a decision. I just see them still kind of pleading their case, still asking for... They have regrets, okay? They, whatever happens here, Pisces, they are very, very regretful. Um, and they may have lost you. But what I see here is um, them asking for your forgiveness you still stuck with the decision to make, whether you want a new cycle or um, go in your own direction. I don't see a decision here. There's a Knight of Wands. There's a Two of Swords. There's a Four of Cups. Trying to figure out if it's worth it. Um, with the Knight of Wands, this person could be inconsistent. There could be addictions here. You're trying to figure out if this is going to be something that can be worked through or not. So you're their dream come true, Pisces. You're their wish fulfillment. You're what they want. They have regrets over what happened here. Um, maybe they didn't show loyalty, but they're wanting to show you now that they're loyal, now that they're committed, now they're, they're real, they're really into this. So you have a choice to make. I still don't see you making it. So I'm just going to see if there's anything else the cards want to say to help you with that choice. Is there anything else you want to say to Pisces? Judgment. Be realistic about who this person is. You know, you have to accept them for who they are. Can you accept them for who they are and move into a long-term relationship? So it really comes down to forgiveness and trust, but it comes down to expectations. Be realistic and ask yourself, can I have a life with this person? That will give you the answers that you need. Um, and Pisces, that's what I got, baby. So if you like my style, if you like your reading, I do ask that you like, comment, subscribe. Helps my channel to grow. Thank you, Pisces. I always appreciate the support, so thank you. Now let's close your reading off today with a yes or no question. If the card comes in reverse, the answer is no. If the card comes upright, the answer is yes. Spirit guides, what's the answer for Pisces? Yes or no? Spirit guides, yes or no? Doctors. All right, you ready, baby? You ready? Yes, that's what I have, Pisces. I truly wish you the best of luck. Until next time.